Once upon a time, in a large forest, there lived many animals, all living together. But one day, a bad lion came, who was just mean to everybody and thought he could eat everybody in the forest. He was vicious and powerful. As a result, he would go about the forest and kill the other animals even when he did not want to eat them. Whenever he was hungry, he would run and chase even the quickest animals and devour them in an instant. As a result, the animals started dwindling in numbers. The animals then came up with an intelligent plan. They went to the lion and said, Our king, please listen to our plea. The rate at which you are hunting us will soon lead to us being extinct. We request you to stay in your den, and in return, we will send you one animal every day as your food. The lion agreed with this convenient arrangement, as he would no longer need to venture out in search of a meal. So the animals sent one animal every day for the lion to eat. Soon enough, it was the turn of the tiny rabbit. He was terrified because he knew he would be gobbled up by the ravenous lion in a flash. But he was also very smart. He waited till afternoon to go to the lion's den. As he walked up to the lion, he devised a brilliant plan. He was determined to beat the lion at his own game. He knew the lion would be famished by now and impatient as ever. So, the rabbit walked even more slowly and finally arrived at the lion's den by sunset. As expected, the hungry lion was pacing up and down. He roared and asked, Why are you so late? And why have they sent me one puny rabbit? As though one little rabbit will satisfy my hunger. He also vowed to kill the other animals in the forest due to their lack of consideration. The rabbit was calm and said, Oh great lion, there were six rabbits in total when we started. But one ferocious lion met us on the way. He took five of the other rabbits. He would not let me go, so I told him we already have you as our mighty king. He was extremely angry and spared me to inform you that he is now the new king. You have to leave the forest at once, or he would kill you, he said. The lion was shocked and enraged to hear this. Take me to this other lion's den, he said to the rabbit. I will kill him and show him who is king indeed. The bad lion thought he could overpower and eat the other five rabbits as well. And so the rabbit took him to a deep well that was filled with water. He lives inside a big cave in this well, the rabbit told the furious lion. As they were both standing on the edge of the well, the rabbit pointed into the well and said, There he is, your majesty. When the lion looked into the well, he saw his own reflection in the water. As reflections in the water appear substantially huge, the silly lion was infuriated. He roared at his reflection inside the deep well. The roar echoed back at him from the well, and the foolish lion thought it was the other lion roaring at him. Without giving it another thought, the lion jumped into the well. Since the well was quite deep, he could not swim and climb back up. The rabbit ran away and left the helpless lion alone in the well. Moral of the story, wisdom outsmarts physical strength.